Hello Taurus and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Central focus, there's somebody who's going to be, they want to fight for this. They want to do everything they can to turn this around, man. They want to fight for this. Um, this is definitely someone from your past. I I always get divine masculine energy off of the magician. Um, they're try yeah. I feel like they're gonna fight for this. Uh, they may even be going up against um, like a family group or a friend group um, because they want you back bad. Uh, they see you as literally everything. Um, the, uh, Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Cups. Uh, six of Cups, this person can't get you off of their mind. Um, they know who it is that they want for sure. <laughs> they are going to fight for this, you guys. For whoever this is for. Look at this. Look at how the cards... Okay, I hope you guys saw this. Look at how the cards fell out. Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, the Emperor. And now this is how the cards split on their own. I did not do this. I cannot make this up. This person wants this new beginning. They want this new beginning with you in love. Um, they're bossing up into the emperor. Okay. And they're coming forward. I'm leaving these out. Yeah. Finding their strength to come forward. They've been thinking about this for a long, long time. Okay. They want their empress. I kid you not. They want their empress. So, yeah, this person, they're coming forward. You don't see this coming, collective. Oh, my gosh. Thank you, Divine. You don't see this coming, but this person is about to apologize. Um, yeah, you have no idea. This person is, like, headstrong. Um, you've already got, we just started. Now, wait a minute. We just started. Let's look at this reading because I'm actually blown away. I'm blown away by this. We've got somebody who literally, they know that they know what they want. They know the truth. They want to come in and fight, fight for you, like in a good way. Okay. <laughs> in a good way. They're not going to fight with you. They're going to fight for you. Okay. Do everything they can to turn this around. We've got already, we're like not even five minutes in and we've got the, uh, the six of cups, the 10 of pentacles, the Ten of Cups, all right? We've got the Ace of Swords, the Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups. We've got the Strength card. We've got your person bossing up. Um, an apology coming in. I mean, come on. You've got so many, many major arcana out here already. <laughs> this is amazing. Okay, so here you are. You're literally everything. And this person knows you're, you're just one pentacle away from being snatched up from by somebody else, okay? This is a single person out here. You're a single person, possibly Virgo. Jeez, I've got Leo out here. Um, you could be any sign, okay? And I, definitely Virgo. You could be dealing with another Virgo as well. But, uh, yeah, I feel like um, you've been, you've possibly been in isolation working on yourselves. Okay, you do not see this coming. You could be, like, um, at work when this happens or whatever it is that you're uh, working on your craft, maybe, when this person comes in. You have no idea. Oh, my gosh, and they're coming in so strong, you guys. Um, you, uh, you're very abundant very independent. You're happy being single. You're not really focused on love, I feel. I feel like you're focused on yourself, your abundance, making bank, right? Um, yeah, and you're one pinnacle away from the ten of, ten of pinnacles. This is per they know they want you. They don't want you with anybody else. This person knows what they want. This is a, this is, this is a divine masculine, I feel. Or just someone bossing up into emperor mode. Uh, I honestly, this reading is blowing me away. Look at this. You've already got, you've got three aces out here and the two best cards in the whole entire deck. The ten of pentacles and the ten of cups. You've got to be kidding me. Um, I don't know who this is for, but I feel like this person's coming when you least expect it. 
and uh, they might just blow your mind like like this reading is blowing my mind. They're coming in really strong. They're going to show a side to you I think you'd never seen before. Uh, for real. With the moon out here, you are not expecting this collective. This is this person's coming in strong. Yeah, they waited way too long. I feel like they were um, in a toxic situation here, but now they're, they're they waited way too long. I feel like you're about to get somebody new. Yeah, you're being seen out there. You're in the public eye, definitely. This is something that could be made public as well, and that could be what um, all of this is about. Like I said, they could be having to fight with uh, friends, a, a friend group, family group, something. Look, this person's being led straight to you. You're in the public eye. They're watching you have a glow up. They're watching you put yourself out there maybe in the dating scene. Um, they've been watching you, Collective, and they know that somebody new is going to come in for you soon, real soon. They cannot have you with anybody else because this person sees you literally as everything. They want to commit. I know that for sure. Oh, boy. It's judgment time. It's time for this person to come forward. Clarify the higher font. You could be a, a spiritual teacher, spiritual, like an empath, a healer, um, a guide for other people. You could, you could be working online, and they're watching you do this. They, you're beautiful. Um, you're healthy, you're strong. I've been eating healthy. Yeah, I have a sleeping energy. Oh boy, oh boy. Um, this person, I, you're their wish fulfillment. They're, they're wishing for you. You're their wish fulfillment. This person's on their way. I'm telling you, you would be anybody's wish at this point. Oh boy. All right. Um, yeah. yeah, they don't want anybody else coming near you is really the feeling that I'm getting here. They don't want anyone else. Ma man, if anyone else makes you that offer this person, they're going to want to get in the way of that. <laughs> See that one pinnacle here? That um, would give you the Ten of Pentacles. I feel like this person, they're about to reach out to you, man. They do not want you to get away. I cannot believe all of the major arcana out here. All of the, I mean, you've got, you've got the best cards in the deck coming out. Right out the gate. Okay, what else can you show me? Yeah, you could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Clarify this devil. You know what? I'm going to, yeah. And on the bottom of the deck, that's, that's over. <laughs> that's over. This person regrets their choice. Now they're coming back to you and they don't want any, if anybody else comes towards you, <laughs> um, collective, they're going to deflect that. Um, yeah. You could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Virgo, um, you could be any sign. We've got almost all of the aces out here as well. Scorpio energy, Taurus, this person. Is <laughs> yeah, I, that was funny. Yeah, I'm like, what about this toxic situation over here, though? Is that over? That's what I'm thinking to, in my head. And I, here's the death card. Yeah, they regretted that decision. They've been heartbroken without you. They don't want to let go. And you're, you're moving forward. And they don't want to let go. This person is not about to let you go and leave their life, for real. Oh my gosh, you could be a Cancer, they could be a Cancer. Clarify the chariot. That toxic situation that they were in, that's done. That is over. Yeah. Oh, man, they played you in the past. They made you stand here. They don't know what to do. They don't know if they can come back from this, but they are. that's why, that's why they have to fight for it. 
That's why they have to do everything they can. Now, here's the thing. I've got, think about this. I've got every, uh, every ace out here in, in the deck except for one. The one I don't have is the wand, okay? Um, we got all three aces, three aces here. The one I don't have is the wand. You know why? Because this person, they know that they played you in the past. The last thing you're going to want is for them to take out that wand, all right? You are not looking for passion right now. They know they need to build up to that. They know that uh, uh, they, can't use, they can't use passion to get you back because that's how they kind of sealed their doom in this connection in the first place. I feel like you feel very used. You feel like this person used you in the past and then kept you sitting here waiting for them, waiting for an explanation while they were trying to decide while they juggled you. That's why we don't see the Ace of Wands out here yet, is because they know they can't bring that. They know they can't bring that. You've had enough of that. Yeah, man. Yeah, and this is one of the reasons why you're leaving the scene, why it's over. I feel like you're, you're ending the situation with this person and they are not going to want to let you go. They're going to use all the other tools that they have at their disposal. We've got the cup. There's the cup. We've got the pentacle on their table. There it is. We've got the sword here on their table. There it is. The only one they know they can't use is that wand on you again because, you know, like I said, that's how the damage was caused in the first place. So this person's going to be doing everything they can, and they're going to try to keep passion and intimacy kind of out of it for now because they know that uh, um, they damaged this connection using you in the past. You see this person as a user. Okay? So other than, other than the wand, they're going to do everything that they can. They're really coming and fighting for this. They really are. They really are collective for whoever this is for. Justice, you could be dealing with um, a Libra. You could be a Libra. They could be going through a divorce case right now because that is over. That is over. They're in a lot of regret for their choices. Yeah, King of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck. Um, this person may need to go through a divorce. They're fighting off a lot of opinions about that, like I said. that I feel like they're going... They, they have to go up against a friend group or a family in order to end that situation, but they're fighting for you. They're defending their, their stance on this. I feel like this person's going to have to go through a divorce, but man, they are not about to let you go. And they know what they did in the past. I feel like, um, yeah, see, they know what they did in the past. They know what they did. Um... That's uh, that's caused no communication. Like, you could even have this person blocked. You could be dealing with the Pisces, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Scorpio, Capricorn, uh, Libra, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Virgo, Cancer. Yeah, and this person, it could be any sign, but they know... They know what they did. That's the reason why there's been no communication. They know that you're guarding yourself. They know that you're blocking this energy out. And you might not even want to talk to them again because of how they treated you. But this person, I am telling you, man, they're like gung-ho about getting back together. Um, yeah, and this connection is just about at its end here. This could have been a twin flame, soulmate connection. You could be a divine feminine. This could be a divine masculine. I'm really picking up on divine masculine vibes. Somebody who's learned their lessons in a toxic situation, bossing up into the emperor. Oh, man. They could have really, really wrecked this connection but they're coming in to do whatever they can to change this around like they are for real they're def they're defending 
uh, their decision against the opinions of other people. They're going to come in fighting for this using every tool they can except for that wand because they know that's how they screwed up the last time. I feel like this person is really worried that they're not going to get you back. I feel like they're really worried and they know they're going to have to put in the work for this. You're going to make them work for it, collective. Man, I f this person, look, oh, I'm telling you, they want to reunite, you guys. I cannot make it up. This is like, uh, your person is so gung-ho about this, like, I can't even describe it, man. I am blown away by this reading. This is, this is beauty right here. Okay, give me one more for the collective. One more. <laughs> you could be a Gemini. Um, I've got Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Yeah, it, see, you're moving forward. You're moving, if you... If you were to decide not to, if you were to decide not to be with this person and keep moving forward, they are going to be shattered. They're going to be shattered. I don't think they'll ever get over the pain of this connection. This person's coming in. I'm telling you what, man. Just as you're moving forward, this person comes towards you, literally fighting with everything they've got except for that wand, <laughs> right? Fighting um, as much as they can for this connection. They are not about to let you go. Wow. Anyway, Collective, um, this blew my mind. Uh, yeah, to have that many awesome cards in your reading. But yes, and that is why we don't see that last ace. That, that wand out here is because they know they took advantage of you in the past and you feel used. So they're going to do everything except for bringing passion to your doorstep, which is good. This person has learned respect now. That, that tells me that they've got a lot of respect. So anyway, um, I do hope this helps. Do hope.